what a great moment. He's the captain of the team, leader of the defense, two-time Pro Bowler, and now two-time Super Bowl champion. Please welcome to live Philadelphia Eagle, Malcolm Jenkins. <laughs> This is your second Super Bowl win. Yeah, the confetti was nice. I... Yeah. <laughs> we, we busted out our St. Patty's Day confetti earlier. Oh, there, there you yeah. go. <laughs> um, uh, congrats. You won uh, when you were with the Saints as well. Yes, right? yes. Yeah. I was a rookie. I was you were a rookie. I was my first year in the league, yep. Wow. And now team captain. So do you, before, for example, the Super Bowl, before the game starts, do you have a speech? Do you say something to the gang? Uh, yeah, so every every game, I kind of break the team down uh, right before we go out. Um, and so this last one, you know, is, I basically told them, look, if we want to be Super Bowl champions, we're 60 minutes away from, from having, you know, a world championship, the first ones in Philadelphia. We get the banner on the stadium and everything. All you got to do is be yourself. Being ourselves got us there. You know, we had everything that we needed. We always break it down on we all we got, we all we need. Uh, and uh, we pulled it through. I mean, it really is incredible because I grew up in South Jersey, so the Philadelphia Eagles, like, that's our team. I don't think you really understand what you did for the people. <laughs> I, like, I don't really, I mean, you really have to be from that area to understand the suffering of the Eagles fans. Well, I'm from, I'm from northern Jersey, so, but, right, uh, but still, so I understand a little I mean, bit. I mean, the suffering has been extreme and extensive. Well, and it's similar to New Orleans. You know, when I won there, that was their first Super Bowl appearance ever, and they used to wear paper bags on their heads and call themselves the Aints. Right. And it's a similar, you know, fan base. Do you think it's you? Could it be you? It might be. It be. Are you the guy? Right? <laughs> you broke you the news. The, the common denominator there. Wait, there was, there, was a, there was a moment in the Super Bowl, if you remember this, where Brady dropped the ball <laughs> and then you went up and gave him a little love it was pat. a little harder than that. Yeah. <laughs> A little love pat. It. What? Dropped what it. were you taunting him? What did you say? There it was. Yeah, yeah. Wait. What did you say? What were you doing? I love so, that. So I knew. First off, I thought he was gonna catch it. So when he dropped it, I was like, thank God. But uh, <laughs> you know, he went to Michigan. I went to Ohio State. So I had to give him a little. I had to taunt him a little bit. So I'm like, hey, come on, Tom. You gotta catch yeah, that. Yeah, oh, yeah. 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 I hit Mark. Yeah. No kidding. It's all right though. But yeah. Just messing with him. And he didn't so, even flinch. Yeah, he didn't yeah. even turn around. Yeah, he didn't. Even now is that is it, is that because he's in his own head or what? Like what's going on? How in your own head are you? Because you seem to be like in everybody's head. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I tried to. As a defender, like you, you look for small ways to get an advantage, and so sometimes you trash talk, sometimes you mess. What do you say? Well, give us some trash. It, it obviously didn't give, work for Tom. Give me a little. Give us some trash. Tell talk. me something. So for me, like if somebody tries to block me and then I make a tackle, I'll turn around and let them know, like you, there's no way you can block me. Is like, that what you say? There's no way you can block. Simple, yeah, I'm Thank you for coming, guy. sir. Yeah, I talked to You're him. Very normally. polite. Like, yeah, like just <laughs> tell your coach to put somebody else out here because you can't do it. Or if a play and doesn't that gets work, I'm like, mind. yeah, I'll turn to, I'll talk to their sideline or their coaches. Like, yeah, throw that play out because it doesn't, it doesn't work. Who's wait? It doesn't work. <laughs> Who is notorious for being the worst smack talker yeah. in the NFL? Good question. For a long while, at least since I was in, been in the league, uh, my favorite trash talker is probably Steve Smith. He's like receiver out of Carolina. Was uh, with um, the Ravens for a while. What does he say? Uh, you can't Can you say any of things that he says. Uh, but and now he's retired, and I'm not sure who the. It was Richard Sherman for a little bit. Now I think Jalen Ramsey is one of the yeah. new guys. Uh, but it's it's uh it's we got some talented trash. I like your league. technique though. Your technique <laughs> is just like it's cordial. Go home. Yeah, I'm annoying. Like I try <laughs> to get it. I, I'm, I'm annoying type of guy. But it's been an incredible year. We were talking before the show. You just welcomed a new daughter. Yeah. And yeah. so Second. you've got you've two. Got two. Uh, two girls. I've had yeah two girls. So. Two Pro Bowls, two Super Bowls. Two, and my two is your number. Yeah, two is right? the number of the year. Yeah, yeah she, was, uh, she was born five days before the NFC Championship game. So, oh, my gosh. Yeah, she went to the game, too. That's, yeah. I mean, so, listen, why not? Your it. other is four? Four, yeah, and just turned four in Did she understand what the Super Bowl was all about? 
So she loves going to games. She, her first game was when she was two weeks, I think, uh, when we were in New Orleans. But all offseason, she was like, every time we drive by the stadium, she's like, are we going to the game? Are we going to the game? It's like, no, nah, the season doesn't start for a couple months, babe. But uh, once we got to the playoffs and we started talking about the Super Bowl, she kept saying the supermarket. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's exciting like We're going to the supermarket, too. yeah. But by the, by the time we won it all and figured it out, she knows that. She'll tell you now, like, Daddy just won a Super Bowl. In Minnesota. She'll say Minnesota, too. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. That's major. Yeah.